What's going on people, back with a bang. This is The Money Management, back here to bring you guys another video for today. And I'm going to be giving you guys a little recap of this past week, the final week of September and the first day of October. So I decided to change it up a little bit and just kind of show you guys a few of the stocks that we profited off of. Uh, I'll show you guys, you know, how this week panned out. And of course, you know, as you can see on screen, I finished the week up, which is really nice. Now to begin with, let's just look at SPY because SPY had a great day today. Well, towards the second half of the day, I had a great day. It just rallied crazy from lows of 427 up to around 435, almost 436 today. And it was very nice to see that bullish momentum going into the first day of October trading. Now, of course, it's weekend, so we're going to see how SPY opens Monday, but I'm definitely intrigued to see how it pans out. But, like I said, it was really cool to see SPY do that movement today. So, uh, the first talk I want to talk about is Microsoft, because Microsoft was the last call out of the week, but it was a stock which rallied from lows of around 283 when we got in to up to 288 today and uh, we had 287.50 calls and they finished in the money which is really nice to see. We also traded a firm ticker symbol AFRM and this was one where again our calls were in the money by before expiry uh, you know we placed the calls when the a firm was around 130 114 dollars and ended up being 120 dollars at one point. So this was really good to see, you know, showing that we can still make money in these tough markets, in these red markets. Another stock that we traded was Farmy, took some with FAMI. This was shares and it was one I announced in my last video. Now these shares have shot up to around the 51 cent mark, which is what I talked about, 50 cent, 51 cent mark before it fell back down. And I did mention to you guys that this was the kind of resistance on this stock. So this was just purely shares, but I think it's still got room to run. Another stock which was purely shares where we were trading, you can trade options on this one, but N Global ticker symbol ENG. This had a great day today. I believe this still has more room to run. Again, we're just playing it as shares. I know there are some people playing it as options as well. But I've announced this in the Discord. I again I also announced this in my last video I uploaded on YouTube. So if you guys did watch that one, you would have seen ENG, you would have seen FAMI as well. And I believe these still have potential to run up. Now the very last stock I want to talk about is Uber. Unfortunately, we lost money on Uber. The good thing was, we know what we were seeing, we were just slightly too early. Uber started downtrending after we got into our $47 course for it. And as you can see, today it finally rallied again. It was just slightly too late for us. So our contracts were down about 50%, even 60% some of them. So yeah, Uber was a bit of a tough one to handle. And that was it for the majority of the stocks we traded this past week. Now I also want to look at a couple of stocks I'm looking at going into next week for some option plays. First, IPOF. If you want to know more about that one, I'm going to talk about that one in the Discord. And next, Aterian, ticker symbol ATER. I'm looking at $12.50 course for this one, expiring October 15th. I will talk more about it potentially in another video on YouTube or also in the Discord. I've explained my rationale, my reasoning behind this one. We're just going to wait on a little pop before we can get some nice profits out of that one and then move on to something else. But I believe that pop is coming. It's a stock which is being squeezed, so please keep that in mind. And that is pretty much it for my week, what, 39 review? Yeah, maybe I'll make another video talking kind of about how September panned out overall. I think it's been a tough month, but October, first half of October, doesn't mean it's going to get any easier. So please be aware of that before you trade, before you do anything. As always, I'm grateful to you guys for tuning in, for stopping by. Make sure you guys check out all those links in the description. And we'll see you guys next time for another video. Peace. Game over.